Hello Sagittarius and welcome to What Sagittarium. My name is Robin and Sag, today we're going to do a reading about the person on your mind. We're going to find out what they're thinking about you, what they're feeling about you, what you can expect from this person in the next couple weeks. So let's talk about your person, Sag. Spirit guides, the person Sagittarius thinks about the most right now. How are they feeling about Sag at this exact moment? Engagement. Okay. So your love life is ascending to a higher level of commitment. So they want to take things to the next level with you, Sagittarius. All right, let's talk about you. Okay, spirit guides, the person. What are they thinking about Sagittarius? How do they feel about them right now? And what are their actions? What can the Sag expect in the next few weeks? They're, they're thinking about you a lot. Okay. The Four of Swords. A lot. <laughs> they might just like lay in bed thinking about you. Um, the Hermit. They're not being quiet. All right, what's going on? Sag, for those of you who are interested, I am uh, doing personal readings. So if you want one of those, the link is in the description box below. The Three of Swords. Sorry, my rock is in the way here. I don't know what happened. Okay. I always go off to the right. I drive myself crazy. Maybe I should just move my chair. <laughs> Maybe I'll do that. Okay, so the Queen of Cups in reverse. So their actions are what you can expect in the next few weeks. The Nine of Cups in reverse. Which is up with this person side? They're confusing. They're confusing. What else we got? The Wheel of Fortune in reverse. And the Three of Pentacles in reverse. And the Emperor. <laughs> well, I'll tell you something about this person. This person does a lot of thinking. Um, this person might not talk a lot. You, um, the Hermit's here. Or they might have not be talking to you. They might be ghosting you. You guys might not be in talking mode. But this person is definitely in thinking mode. They want to be your emperor. They want to take control of this. Like, I feel like you dug your claws into this person. They can't escape you. Um, but yet this person has some kind of healing to do. Oh, my God. The star. You're everything this person ever wanted. What is wrong with this person? Cross watcher. What are you doing? <laughs> you the five of pentacles. There's them looking at you. But I, I don't see them. They're just thinking about you. They're looking at you. They're disappointed. They're not working on this. They're frustrated. The timing is off. So... This person thinks the world of you. They and they can't stop thinking about you. Like I said, I feel like they're just like laying in bed thinking about you. But the four of we are sorry, what am I saying? I know I'm all confused and distraught because I don't understand. <laughs> I don't understand the silence. Let's talk about the hermit first. What's the silence? What's the hermit? What is this? Why is this person behaving in such a manner? The ace of cups. And the two of pentacles. Oh. Oh, your person. Let's put that. The magician in reverse and the temperance in reverse. Your person's, um, they got some regrets. They got some things that they're, they want this, but they're, I feel like, I don't know, with the two of pen, the two of pentacles is about juggling all different things. Like, look at her, she's a little stressed. She's trying to hop here. She's got all this, I feel like this is cool. Try to burn her. She's trying to carry this bear, whatever the hell that thing is. She's, you know, trying to carry her baby. She's just trying to deal with too much. So your person has a lot on their plate and I feel like they've pulled back and retreated. The eight of cups in reverse, though they regret the decisions that they've made here by blocking this or pulling back from this. They're Like I told you, they're obsessed with you. Like, like I don't, I'm not sure I use obsessed very often, but they're really, like they literally are laying there thinking about you. They want this with you. Um, and let's talk about the wheel of fortune. So why is it not the right time in the next two weeks? Because... They're ready for this with, with, um, with Sag. They want this. <laughs> so what is the Wheel of Fortune in reverse? The Emperor. Oh, well, that's lovely. We already know this. The Seven of Pentacles. The Queen of Swords. And the Four. There's them being silent. So it, it, for, according to this person, now is not the right time. It is just the timing isn't right. There's something, there's some reason here. They're pretty silent. They're pretty mysterious. Your person's um, hidden. <laughs> they're, um, but they want this and they want to take control of this. I feel like they want to change the, there's the ace of, and look what it cut on for sure. So I understand why you're doubting the way that this person feels. This person's like silent. They, like I said, they might've ghosted you or there's just a lack of communication, but they're thinking so much about you. And it's just not the right time. Is there anything you want to say about that? And there's the four swords. They're just holding back. They're just staying silent. Why? Oh, 
They're just watching you. <laughs> and the three cups. So this you can be assured of. This person's coming back for you. I be sure be assured of that. Like rest assured. Let's say this properly, Sag. Rest assured. This person's coming back for you. But they're right now they're just watching you and waiting. Um so if you got like, you know, Facebook or Instagram or YouTube or whatever, like they're watching you, they're keeping their eye on you. Um, they want to reconnect with you. They want to reunite in the next couple of weeks. No, it's not the right time according to this person, but damn, they consider you their soulmate, like the, the star and the lovers. So with the emperor, yeah, they want to, um, they got to drop something first here. There's a three of pentacles. So like, I'm just being drawn to these mean ass mofos back here. So I feel like <laughs> they're, <laughs> you know what I'm feeling? Um, it's funny because when I read, like a lot of it is the feeling and I have to express how I'm feeling, but I feel like this is you kind of enjoying your life. They might see you posting your photos, going out with your friends and your family or whatever. And they're like, I'm not with Sag. This sucks. Um, and they're just watching you sulking. That's what I feel. So there's something going on. It is not the right time for this person. They can't at the moment, but damn, do they want to? Do they want to? And they're mad actually. Yeah. And the magician that they can't, like I said, I feel like they're watching you and they're like, I want to be with my Sag, but I can't, you know, and they're, they can't say anything. So I don't know. I'm going to see if they can provide any other clarity on the reason for the silence or the lack of timing, but sometimes it's a general reading. So that, you know, I don't know. I get curious, but sometimes I get told too. What do you want to say? Um, that's all. <laughs> the cherry, it's just not the right time. What the hell? So this is like a soulmate connection. There's a strong connection. This is someone that you're matched with. You're balanced with, like there's a damn rainbow in these cups, but this person is going through something and um, yeah, there you are. So there's the, the right, the wrong time. It's this, I, the, I don't see any action from this person. So I can go on and on, but let's move on and see what the oracles want to say to you, Sag. But I don't see this person doing anything in the next couple weeks. So let's see if you, if we hear from them in a couple months or if they're, I'm sorry, in a month, or if they're ready to finally progress in a month. But right now, they're just laying around thinking about you and pissed that they can't be with you. <laughs> That's lovely. Just lovely. Um, what does Sag need to surrender to here? Rest and sleep to prevent burnout. Slow down. Honor your need for quiet time and peaceful sleep to rejuvenate your mind, body, and spirit. In the caring connection. Oh, guys, sorry. The sun just like popped through. So I got to put that curtain up. If it's coming on here and it just made everything look weird, I apologize. Um, I can't control the sun. <laughs> What is the carry connection between Saji and this person on their month? Damn, that would fly. Hold on. Hold on. Open this. Be ready to accept divine guidance in your relationships. Okay. So the hidden truth. Hold on. Let me grab my seat again. I'm going to move it while I'm up here because I think I should. There we go. The hidden truth for Sagittarius. If this person could say something that they want to say that they're not saying, that they can't say, what would they say? What does Saj need to know? Sure, guys. I will wait for a sign from you. Oh, it's telling me to take the bottom. I'm becoming a better person. So you make them want to be a better version of themselves. Kind of beautiful. Kind of beautiful. What do you need to let go of, Sag? Your glass is always refillable. Flow like water instead of holding on to perceptions. Ooh. Okay, so let's get your potential outcome. So I say potential because there is always free will. You're going to make the decisions you're going to make, and so is this person. An outcome, let's see where you guys are in a month. Does this person feel the timing's better? <laughs> like, are they doing something? Or are they just sitting there thinking about you? Spirit guides, what are sides in this person on their mind in a month? How are they doing? We got ourselves the Seven of Cups and the Ace of Wands in reverse. And we got ourselves the Three of Pentacles in reverse here. I don't know about this person's side. I don't know what's going on here. So the four of pentacles and there's the emperor in reverse. That's what I thought. Um, I feel like you have options here and you're not going to sit here and wait. So there's other people in the mix. I feel like a part of you is holding on to them. A part of them is holding on to you, but there's just some reason that they can't come forward and you get sick of waiting. And I just see other people here. Um, so the seven of cups and the ace of wands in reverse with this emperor, nothing is going with this person. You're still kind of hoping in the background, wishing that they'll come through, wishing that they'll come in, but they haven't. Um, but there's someone else here. <laughs> so you have other options, and I feel like you're putting this person on the back burner. Um, you snooze, you lose, buddy, you snooze, you lose. And, um, but, but there's still, 
you're, you're still holding on to them and them to you, but um, what do you want to say about the options for Sag? The Knight of Pentacles. And the Star in reverse and the Knight of Cups in reverse. It's just, it's not telling me about your options. <laughs> it's telling me that you're just not waiting for this person, so. Um, the Knight of Pentacles in reverse and the Star in reverse. Like, this is the energy of them needing to heal, them needing to go through what they need to go through. Um, and you're just not waiting. So... Yeah, Ten of Pentacles in reverse. So when this person wants to come around, they will. And I guess it'll be up to fate as to where you are. But in the next month, no, look at this. You're moving on to bigger and better things. It's not going anywhere. This person's, I don't know what's going on with this person. They're a damn mystery. Um, so Sag, I'm sorry it wasn't the best ending. But, I mean, you do have other options and better things to look forward to in fun. <laughs> this is with this person. They're just sitting there mad that they're not with you, but there's something holding them back. Um, that's what I have. So I'm sorry it wasn't a better ending, but I do hope you enjoyed your reading. Um, if you did, please like, comment, subscribe. Helps my channel to grow. I always appreciate the support. Let's get your final message here and see what the guides want to say. To be a good parent, you need to take care of yourself so that you can have the physical and emotional energy you need to take care of your family. So if you are a parent to a child or for a baby... What are your favorite ways to take care of yourself? How can you ensure that you have time for these each day? And for one who finds joy within the self, rest satisfied within the self, and whose life is dedicated to self-realization, there remains nothing further than for that person to accomplish. I find this one really confusing. you got to wrap your brain around that, in my opinion. How has the quality of life began since your self-care journey? Reflect on and celebrate your progress. Sag, that's what I have for you. I truly wish you the best of luck. Until next time.